question I have an episode on my page um, a couple of months ago I was talking about the signs of being affected with the jinn I think that was aired live from the Masjid of Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam two episodes uh, you can check them out because they're kind of long but in brief yes uh, sorcery or magic uh, which is also done by utilization of the jinn can hurt a person and can cause separation between the husband and his beloved wife and between the friends those who are very close friends or the family members it can affect the person negatively but all of that only by the leave of Allah check ayah number one or two of surah al-baqarah the second chapter of the quran in which allah the almighty said when he spoke about sorcery and magic and whoever learns that has disbelieved in allah the almighty he said وَمَا هُمْ بِضَارِّينَ بِهِ مِنْ أَحَدٍ إِلَّا بِإِذْنِ اللَّهِ So before that he said فَتَعَلَّمُونَ مَا يَضُرُّهُمْ وَلَا يَنْفَعُهُمْ Okay So they learn what? What it harms What it harms and it doesn't benefit وَيَتَعَلَّمُونَ مَا يَضُرُّهُمْ وَلَا يَنْفَعُهُمْ He said فَيَتَعَلَّمُونَ مِنْهُمَا For instance they learn how to separate between the person and his spouse yes they can cause that but whatever harm happens as a result of sorcery or magic or black magic or the utilization of the jinn Allah the Almighty confirmed it only happens by the leave of Allah وَمَا هُمْ بِضَارِينَ بِهِ مِنْ أَحَدٍ إِلَّا بِإِذْنِ اللَّهِ except by the